Well, I just don't understand why you guys are all looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> This man needs an ego stroke, bro. Golly, Jay, calm down. Yo, what's up, guys? Prince Charming. We're going to be checking some Honoré. I think that's how somebody told me in the comment section how to pronounce his name. Honoré Terbia. Jake Paul, the hero nobody asked for. Four. So this is another KSI, Logan Paul, Deji, Jake Paul situation. The fight has yet to happen. I think it's August 25th. Honestly, at this point, I'm tired of all their talking. I just want the fight to happen. Like, all they do is just talk, 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 talk. At this point, I really just want to see them throw hands. I don't want to see any more videos, any more fake drama they're starting, any more manipulation. I just literally want to see the fight. I'm sure a lot of y'all agree with me. Like, in the beginning, this was fun. This was like a fun drama beef. This was a fun situation. Watching them post other videos videos about each other but now it's just like bruh shut up and fight especially Deji I swear if he posts another video another clickbait video about Jake Paul or the fight about something just something annoying bruh quit it just fight already damn I don't know why I'm getting so mad over it it's just so frustrating like bruh it's only 15 days away or 14 days away but y'all are still talking 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 just throw them patasas and fight but this is called the hero nobody asked for and they're referring to jake paul so i don't know how jake paul's a hero he's never been a hero to me i'm sure he's nobody's hero <laughs> i don't hate the guy it's just i'm not gonna give him a hero title but don't forget to hit me with a like subscribe and go ahead and comment who you have on the fight like always ksi logan paul or then deji and then jake paul my current situation because i have been switching back and forth my current situation is i do think KSI will win against Logan Paul. Jake Paul will still be Deji, like it always been. But I have a little more faith in KSI. He just has that he just has that drive. He has that motivation. And I think Logan Paul doesn't really realize that. He thinks he's, you know, a weaker opponent while KSI just has a much stronger drive, which really does help in a fight. But enough of me talking, let's go ahead and check out Jake Paul, the hero nobody asks for. Hope you guys enjoy the video. So right now there's a lot of back and forth between KSI and Logan. There's Jake so Paul much back and forth. Everyone's talking about the boxing match. And honestly, I can't deal with that anymore. KSI put out a new video. Logan Paul Exactly. Put out a new video. Like it's just fight. too much at this point. Just Let fight, them just bro. Punch each other in the mouth and be done with it. So we're gonna take a left turn here and talk about something that's it's almost slipped under my radar because while the whole YouTube community was focused on the boxing match, Jake Paul silently dropped what I think is one of the greatest undiscovered gems of YouTube cringe. That's right, I'm YouTube talking cringe. about Sherlock Paul Season 1. I love how there's seasons of this thing already, by the way. And if the first couple episodes are any indicator, this is gonna be my new favorite show. So let's take out our magnifying glass and take a look at the cringe. You think he's Sherlock Holmes Sherlock now? Paul. All right. Sorry. What are you doing? Let's see Detective no, Jake. You can't be dressed as Sherlock. <laughs> because I'm dressed as Sherlock. You have to be Watson. I'm sorry. I like his little mascot oh, he has. This is so cute what he's doing right here. Oh. Okay, fine. He can, can be Sherlock. Be Sherlock. All right, let's see Jake Paul's Sherlock series. I have no clue what this is about to go. So on Sherlock to do. Paul is a new episodic show on Jake Paul's channel, and it's just mind bending. This is your mind, and this is what will happen to. Ugh, that's like a oh, oh, spoiler ding alert. Dong. It's gonna bend. Get it? M mind bending. We start off with Jake Paul sitting down candidly with the camera, preparing us for what we're about to witness. Okay. What you guys let's are hear it. about to see was easily, easily, one of the craziest days of my life. God damn it, Jake, you got me on the edge of my seat here. <laughs> Seriously, you aren't, you aren't going to believe this story. Okay, to get to it. To purposely break someone else out of jail. You should I honestly thought he was serious at first. I really thought he went to jail. Now you're saying he's, he's on prison break? Is the series coming back? <laughs> I heard about the Team 10 and like... All of them have left Jake, and like it's not even a team no more, really. I, who is still in Team Ten? Please let me know down in the comment section. I'm pretty sure Chance left, Tessa left, those twins left. Well, actually, both twins left. Like, damn, bro, how much mem members are you going through? Is Jake Paul really that evil to his friends? Because I know Chance, he's known for a while. So if Chance leaves, he had to have really done something bad. Like, you don't leave your brother that you've known since Ohio, since the old days. But, I mean, I can see it in his videos. Jake Paul can be a very mean person. And having him as a boss, I would not want that either at all. Just stop that. I went to jail. I, I would have been fine with that. Then we cut to this totally little. Oh, she kind of cute. Reporter. This is Michelle Diaz reporting live from a local community on the street. Um, 
We just got a report about a Katie Johnson <laughs> that was just arrested for Grand Theft Auto. She a YouTuber. I don't know about you, Wilfer, but this seems pretty legit to me. So the story goes there is a girl who gets pulled over by the cops. Cop goes, lady, this car is stolen. And she's like, but I got it as a gift from my boyfriend. <laughs> Your boyfriend Somehow stole it. No investigation. They just lock her up like she's a Hillary Clinton. <laughs> we just talked to Katie's family. They say this is just another example of how unjust the American criminal system is. I Not to white people. Supposedly are just like, yeah, man, it's just <laughs> an example of how unjust the justice system is. But your daughter is going to be in prison for a long time. Yeah, man, that's it's pretty just sad. It's sad, that man. Darn justice system. <laughs> You're not going to do anything about it? I mean, what can we even do? I mean, get, get a lawyer. I don't know. To me, it sounded like this whole, like, crazy, like, crime thing. And you guys know I love, like, the, like, crime stuff and, like, investigation and, like, <laughs> justice law stuff. What's he doing? Uh, it's okay, hand. guys. We have Jake Paul here. He doing some ninjutsu. Justice law stuff. <laughs> Maybe he's gonna do something about it. And obviously, I have like this character Sherlock Paul that like helps to solve crimes and like mysteries. Now, hold on a second. This is the picture you come up with. That's not even you. Show titled Sherlock Paul, and you can't even is get it? a decent Photoshop going. It is. Kill me. So Jake Paul sees this news report and starts investigating right away. It's not like he has a boxing match to train for or anything. <laughs> so he invites the sister of this girl over to the Team 10 house to hear out the whole story. So like, Is this like the end of Jake Paul and the end of Team 10? Because I remember his content, while like I didn't really care for him, it used to be way better. Like He used to do all these extreme challenges with his friends and the whole Team 10 house. Is this really the downfall of Jake Paul? Are we seeing it live happening? Is this fight not even going to bring back his career? And then the comment that uh, Andre made about focusing on the fight that he has. I really don't think Deji is focusing on it. I really don't think Deji's practicing like that. I think Jake Paul, eh, I think they're on the same level of practicing. All I know is that KSI is putting in the most work without a doubt. But I low-key, low-key want Deji to win just so I can be proved wrong. Just so I can be in a moment of pure awe. And I would be like, wow, Deji, I have doubted you and you came out victorious. I will apologize live on camera and everything. But until then, <laughs> Jake Paul, <laughs> he's going to land a haymaker on you. I'm not happy about it. I'm just saying, bro. Stop making videos about the fight and actually learn how to fight. When a president is given, you think someone buys it and they give it. And they cannot act, bro. They call themselves actors. Oh, I used to be an actor. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How's your family? I love how this guy just steps in. How is your family handling this? And you know Jake Paul is probably thinking, I'm sorry, does this show have your <laughs> name on it? Because last time I checked, it was Sherlock Paul. Yep. Not Sherlock, random guy. Jake Paul's going to hit him as soon as the camera Got turns it. off. And like, we know she's innocent. And like, we tried to put it in public, you know, like social media, like bump it up and stuff. We tried like social media. We tried everything. No, you didn't try everything. You didn't try getting oh, a lawyer. lawyer. Wilford, Thank give me you. The goddamn yellow pages. <laughs> There's thousands of lawyers in here. Pick one at random, call him up, and your sister is going to be home by supper. <laughs> that easy. That's it's that true. easy. We wouldn't have this amazing show otherwise. But I'm just pointing out the facts here. You can tell they didn't plan this out properly because the improv is just so bad. Yeah, the improv is awful. Someone like going in and breaking her out. Wait, did you just say that the only other option? Oh, that dude's still there? Wow. Like, went in there and broke her out. Jesus Christ, man. There's more build up to this than the fucking Lord of the Rings. <laughs> it's not crazy, <laughs> This yep, he's mad. It's just fantastic because you know Jake Paul was like, so then you're all gonna look at me and I'm gonna be like, oh, guys, I don't want to do it, and he milks the shit out of this scene. Why are you guys looking at me? I don't know. I'm not doing it. You're dirt from Disney, bro. You do dirt. You're crazy. Well, I just don't understand why you guys are all looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> this man needs an ego stroke, bro. Golly, Jay, calm down. Just say you're gonna do it like you were gonna do it. <laughs> Everyone's like, okay, Jake, let's move it along. But he's like, no, no, we have to make it clear that I don't want to go to jail, but true heroes are willing to make sacrifices. I can't believe they actually agreed to film this, bro. Were y'all not thinking that this just looks awful and terrible? Give this man an Oscar.
or a raspberry. A screwdriver and a GoPro <laughs> and shoves them up his ass. I'm not even joking, by the way. They call the police, making up some excuse that Jake Paul is trespassing, so he gets put in handcuffs. And just like are those that, really cops? Jake Paul goes to jail. At this point, we fade to a scene where okay, we see the girl for the first time this being interrogated fake. by a police officer, and I don't know who this 60-year-old guy is, but you can tell he's still dreaming of getting that Oscar. Katie, you have to stop lying to us now! I think you know then what more than what you're saying. You know a lot more than what you're saying. What? Look me in the eyes, tell me you did not steal that. <laughs> Fam, that has been low-key the most awful acting I've ever seen. How they, why are you just going to turn up on a girl because she was caught for Grand Theft Auto? She's already in jail. Y'all already locked her up. Why are you interrogating her? That usually happens after the fact, you know? They already have their conviction, or apparently they did, because she's in jail. Unless they put her in jail until her hearing. That would be the only way that they wouldn't be interrogating her. But other than that, bro, why are you slamming the desk like you really fit to hit this girl? I'm not going to bash them too much because the props, the whole, you know, they, they put into work in this. They actually had a cop car. I don't know if it was a real cop car. I don't even know if it was a real cop. Pretty sure it was a real cop that they just knew. And they actually had, like, the interrogation room. I mean, they did put a little money into this. It's just the acting, bro. You got to realize acting really does it all. Oscar goes to the old man in Jake Paul's YouTube video. Sorry, Daniel Day Lewis, you can't have it your way. Oh, all the time. sorry, Daniel. Then we cut to Jake in his cell, who by this point already took the GoPro out of his ass. This is really a cell, know, though. Prisons there are in California, but what are the odds, Wilfer? What do you think are the odds of Jake Paul being placed in the exact same jail in the exact? I thought cell guys right and girls came and be in the same jail. Out? <laughs> That's exactly what I thought. I was just freaking out, man, and like my emotions were run running and running and. I <laughs> yeah, kids are gonna believe anything this yep, dude says. That's the first truthful thing you said. Y'all believe 30 minutes YouTube couples are real? No. They're not. <laughs> I broke in here to get you out. How are we gonna get out? I have a screwdriver. Oh, because that's gonna work. That's all you need, I'm right? She didn't go. What? Are you fucking kidding me? No, it's a screwdriver. Look, I'm gonna break us out of here with this. Did you just pull that out of your ass? Get that fucking thing away from me. Darn, can I please be put in a different jail cell? But obviously, that's not what happens. We see Sherlock Paul pick the lock of his jail cell, even though there's clearly no keyhole there. You're actually pretending to pick an inexistent lock. You plagued yourself. Then I guess somehow they become invisible because they're just walking through this jail and nobody's seeing them apparently. Like I said, I'm gonna give him credit for all the scenes and all the acting not acting all the props and like real cops because this looks like a real jail does it not a real holding jail i should say not a real penitentiary jail a real holding jail at a police station pretty dope what he's doing but it's just bruh you have a fight to focus on you don't need releasing sherlock home netflix episodes on your youtube channel and kids will believe anything that's really why he didn't have to spend so much time on the acting kids will believe anything y'all believe these youtube pranks are real y'all believe the couples are real y'all believe breakups are real y'all believe that whole uh flight and mega mcqueen fight was real that is the most fakest thing ever you know why because they're all reacting to the video all making it like 20 something minutes plus and all putting 15 ads on it and they all just go back and forth back and forth back and forth and they always have a camera on them how do y'all not realize when something is fake everyone's just you know minding their own business and she, she just literally walked by this guy how narrow is your field of vision if you're not seeing two grown-ass people walking yeah directly by you're legally blind <laughs> you need to get arrested okay. he low-key probably helped them out the they paid him first literally breaking it out of jail I don't know if this is illegal uh, I don't know if this is illegal it hurts at this point I can't I can't uh. I just said and I quote we're literally breaking out of jail I don't know if this is illegal pretty sure the cops won't what? like that what? <laughs> then they run towards the getaway car. The team is all hyped up to see them, except the sister, apparently, who's Please. like, oh Guys, my... can we go? Wait, what? They're not in the car yet. <laughs> what do you mean, can we go? I know they're just about to be in the car, <laughs> but guys, can we go? Imagine Fire the sister. Imagine and left them there, dumbfounded in the middle of a field. You know, the guards catch up to them, and... That's how it ends. They go back to jail. <laughs> and for course, a very long time, too. The sisters are reunited. There's emotional music in the background. And we fade back to narrator Jake. And so Aww. We re I'm going to be honest. Like, sisters. this was a, like, a creative idea. It's just, I'm too old to watch that. I've ever done. 
it, it just it just how we do it on this channel. His guys. knee tattoo is Smash weird or leg like tattoo. By. Now hold on a second. That's it? That's how we do it on this channel? It's not over yet. The police is still looking for you. You didn't fix anything. <laughs> just go back to jail tomorrow. <laughs> if any of this were real, you would be the worst Sherlock in the history of Sherlock's. Even Wilfer is a better Sherlock than you. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, Wilfer is way better saying, than you. You're a better mess Sherlock with anybody than else. Paul. And you know, I'm a better Sherlock than you. That's just the facts of life. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. There's no way you're a better Sherlock than me. I don't Sherlock talk to your you bird like, like that. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Let's let the audience decide. But that was it for that video, guys, and I hope you enjoyed it. So, honestly, in all honesty, like I said, this was a good video by Jake Paul. The whole busting out of jail and whatnot. This was a good video for kids. Like me, like I said, I can't watch that. I'm too old. I know it's fake. It's bad acting. I see right through it. But for kids, it's a creative idea. He had good scenes. He had mm, acting. <laughs> yeah, good props. And he was in an actual jail or police holding center, I should say. So yes, it is cringe, but honestly, YouTube is cringe. The most cringiest things are what's popular because kids run YouTube and kids love cringe. That's why they love these YouTube couples and whatnot. But don't forget to leave me a like, subscribe, and comment on this video. If you want to apply from your truly Prince Charming. My name is Prince of Hawk and stay charm, my friends.